find my way. Courted by me, yeah. Oh, forgive me, Father. Oh, crap, my battery's low. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Esther K. Tupate. If you're new to my channel, so this is another video on does it work? Does it really, really work? I have a series called Does It Work series, and in this series, I basically test new things to see whether or not it works. So, in today's video, I'm going to be testing this hack, which um, requires you to apply eyelid primer on your nose to make sure that your foundation stays, your makeup stays on your nose throughout the day. You know, sometimes when we beat our face, at the end of the day, like about five to six hours later, now this is on personal experience. The makeup does rub off on your nose. I feel like you have part of your nose. You know what I'm saying? You, you know, you know. If you know what I'm talking about, this video is for you. So I want to test out whether or not this hack works. There's been two other YouTubers that I've seen that have done this. Nikia Joy posted a tutorial on this met method about a week ago, a week ago. But she didn't really show us what um, the after effect, you know, the outcome is like at the end of the day. Remember, oh my Bell TV talked about this as well in a recent video. In a, makeup to, in, in a makeup tutorial video she uploaded a while ago she said someone told her about it and she tried it she also didn't really show us what it looked like at the end of the day now i don't know if she showed on the social media site anyway i'm gonna put a link to those two videos in the description box down below my battery's running flat and please go and check that out for yourself so if you'd like to see whether or not this hack works to keep your makeup on your nose all day all day for me is mainly about eight hours so i'm gonna set a timer for eight hours so if you like to see whether or not this hack works make sure you keep on watching and if you haven't subscribed make sure you go and subscribe click the subscribe button that looks just like this or click the link down below so that way you can be notified every time i upload a video i upload videos twice a week and turn on your notification as well and also make sure you like this video comment down below let me know what you think of this hack would you try it and share because sharing is caring thanks so much for watching as always whatever you do as long as you love yourself and i'll see you in my next video bye yeah so i'm gonna go and do my brows and i'll be right back so brows are done so now i'm gonna move ahead with the face so this hack requires you to apply eyelid primer um eyeshadow primer eyelid primer on your t-zone area and the eyelid primer we're going to be using today is the mac pro longwear paint pot in laying low and i'm just going to apply that we're just going to see how it goes this is going to be my first time doing this so we're just going to try it together we're going to find out whether it worked or not so gosh i have long nails so i can't get in there so nikki and joy actually mentioned that apply primer everywhere else but don't apply it where you're gonna apply the mac pimple i think it's because of that, that way it can actually get into the skin so i'm just gonna apply it sparingly on my t-zone area like right now as i'm touching my forehead i can already feel the oil coming through like seriously you know i'm dry everywhere else but my forehead and my nose and right here is where the oil comes through okay so now i'm gonna apply my regular primer on, on the perimeter of my face avoiding the areas where i just applied the matte paint pot okay so now i am gonna go on with my foundation i'm not gonna color correct again today because i'm not i'm not going anywhere at all and you know there's no need to be too extra on my makeup maybe i should have filmed this this video tomorrow when i'm actually going somewhere but i just really want to get this video out for you guys just in case there are other people who wants to know what the outcome of this hack is you know about eight hours later all right so now the foundation i'm using today as of course is the cat Von D foundation and i'm going to shade dip 74 and i'm going to apply it on the perimeter of my face first okay i'm just gonna put, i'm actually scared to go over it with a foundation now <laughs> i don't know because the color is quite different i need to make sure this foundation works in well so. all right now i've got my brush and i'm just gonna apply the foundation all over the perimeter of my face first so um around the nose as she said i'm just gonna be dabbing it in and then doing a swiping motion that i'm doing here so i'm just gonna dab it in because that is what she did in the video actually so i'm gonna do the exact the exact same thing she did to see whether or not this really does work this is so weird guys i feel like i didn't blend the foundation on my nose too well and it feels quite sticky but we're gonna keep working with it yeah we're gonna keep working with it so i'm just gonna set the foundation in place as i usually do and i'm using the black opal deluxe Yoshi powder in dark and i'm just setting the foundation in place with it all right this is what my nose looks like right now as you can see just showing you what my nose looks like there's no oil nothing at all because i just put my foundation on i just put everything on and right now the time is 14 12 right now so we're gonna start the timer from now because my foundation is in place now yeah i'm just gonna do a little bit of a contouring and whatnot and we're gonna leave it like this and we're gonna see how it is in about eight hours so i'm gonna set 
my timer for eight hours. I'm gonna start it starting from now. This is what my nose looks like. Again, I probably need to touch it up a little bit, but right now I really haven't bothered. But this is what my nose looks like. Yeah, this is what my nose looks like right now. I'll see you in about eight hours, just probably like two seconds for you guys. So I'll see you real soon. Three, two, one. Happy New Year! So, hey guys, I'm back. So it's been eight hours on the dot. I made sure I come down here when I was about 45 seconds or so left. And yeah, so here we are. This is my face eight hours later. And yo, I'm gonna tell you right now, even though I've been inside all day, the majority of the time I've had the eater on because it is still quite cold here in Australia. So I guess that kind of simulates me being in the hot weather as well. I'm gonna bring you closer so you can see what my nose looks like now. It's not bad, not bad. It's, I, I like this. It's not bad at all. Like my nose, yes, it does look sheen. Like, yeah, it looks sheen. It looks um moist, you know what I mean? When I touch it as well, like I've been trying to touch my nose, y'all. But when I touch it, there's still there's a little bit of grease there. And I'm just going to blot using the tissue paper. So I'm going to separate facial tissue and I'm going to blot with it. Nice and soft and I'm just going to blot with it to see if there's anything that will come through. Okay, there's a little bit of oil, but it's not like... Mm, you know what I mean? But I can honestly say that my makeup stayed on my nose all day. Yeah, I can say it stayed on my nose. I like it. So if I were to answer the question, does it work? I'll say yes, it does work. So I'll give this a uh, thumbs up that yes, this hack does work. I like this hack. I think I would do this hack once in a while. I would do once in a while because I wouldn't want my MAC pin pot to finish that quick just because I'm trying to, you know, prevent my makeup from rubbing off my nose you know what i'm saying if you did try this technique out please let us know down below if it worked for you i'd actually i'd really like to know if it worked for everybody as well particularly people that you know find it hard to maintain their makeup on their nose and here as well next time i do it again if i end if i end up having different results i'm gonna make sure i update you guys in the description box down below let's ignore that so that is it guys thanks so much for watching i hope you enjoyed this hack in my does it work series if you did please give this video a thumbs up comment down below let me know what you think about this hat is it something you're already doing or is it something that you wouldn't mind trying do you know what i mean and also share this video because sharing is caring just in case there are other people that need this hack as well i'm gonna put a link to the videos down below my bell and nikki or joy's video down below so make sure you go check that out thanks so much for watching as always whatever you do is want to love yourself and i'll see you in my next video bye